What is up? I love basketball TV. It's Coach Ryan Rizuki. Today I'm here with Riley and I'm going to show you the four different crossovers that you need to add to your bag. Let's get to it. Your first one is going to be here. You're going to start with a right to left. You're going to skip and then explode. So all it is is here. Cross. Kind of just hang it. Chill. Relax. And then be explosive out of that. All right. Chill. Boom. Very nice. Good. Let's go the other way. Hang it with left to right. Explode to the basket. Chill, go. Very nice. Now this setup crossover, we can also have a change of direction afterwards. So let's set it up right to left. Boom. And explode between the legs. Relax. Oh, no, no, no. Do it again. To set it up, if I want to go right, I need to create more distance laterally to move my defender and have their momentum going this way, which opens up my between and attack that way. So create more distance laterally. There it is, go. Perfect. Switch it. So now left to right, hang it to the right side to open up your drive to the left. Good, go. Perfect. All right. So there's our first one. Now off of this, sometimes what happens instead of the defender cutting us off is they just back up. So off this cross, you might hang and then quickly get into that shot. As long as you look like you're a little bit relaxed, the defense also will relax. Maybe they'll back up. They won't choose a side and the shot's available for you. All right, so shoot that one there. Good, quick. There it is. Very nice. Good hit, other way. Good hang, quick. There it is. Very nice. Put a pop into that shot. Now, when we do our Iverson cross, it's important that we do not skip with the feet. When we Iverson, it's pushing off that left. Right foot here, right foot here. And then we run. So our feet continue to move. And this is where the most common mistake players make. I used to make this mistake a lot, where you cross and you do that little skip and you don't need that. You want to get past someone, you got to keep that right foot going across. Don't skip and run. You skip to counter. You skip to set up. You don't skip to blow by. All right, let's go. Nice. So do me a favor, because we can help you make that crossover a lot better. You did this, which I'm glad you did. Cross, and as soon as you cross, you put the ball down. Try to run further before you put the ball down. I know that you can cross from here, take one dribble and get a layup. Not two. Drop. There it is, run, that's one. That's perfect. So you took your second dribble here, and that's much better than your first one. That's well done. Okay, now go left to right, try the same thing. Iverson cross. Very slow, but I'll take it. Try again. That's okay. You gotta walk through your first reps. Nice, that's the one. Very nice, okay? So there's our Iverson cross. Now, typically when you Iverson cross, you can use this to blow by, right? Because you're gonna be a little more shifty. They think you're going that way, and so that way you get your blow by. But what also happens sometimes is because the defense falls back and they're trying to cut off that right so much, when you cross over, they might be able to recover on the left because they backed up so much. So now hit that same crossover. As that right foot comes across, you're going to shoot it. So Iverson, right there, into that jumper. There it is. Perfect. Other way. Knocked down. Very nice. Good hit. And then, of course, you always have different counters. So. You can Iverson change directions, or you can Iverson one dribble change directions. And I'm fine with both. Iverson, change. Perfect. Very nice. Now give me Iverson change with no dribble between it. Quick, quick. Oh, very nice. Perfect. All right, and there's the counter off of it. Of course, there's gonna be different variations. So, so far we did Iverson blow by, Iverson pull up, Iverson counter. All right, there's your Iverson. Now we'll move on to our pro cross. So with our pro cross, the easiest way to understand this is if you take your thumb and you kind of run it across your belt. So I'm going from my right pocket, run it across my belt to my left pocket. With a normal crossover, you're going under both knees. All right, our Iverson. The ball travels below both knees. But with the pro cross, it actually travels above both knees. So I'd be here. Boom. Okay. First question is, is it a carry? No, because I don't put my hand under the ball. So if I'm here and I cross over right there, it's not a carry. The moment it's a carry is when I, huh, huh, and my hand goes underneath. So as long as I'm tight, 
I can explode and turn my shoulder. All right. So let's go left hand first. You're just coming here. We'll keep it nice and simple. Just come down. Boom. Right off that bounce. Turn that crossover. Run your thumb through your belt and attack the basket. Very nice. Now let's focus on turning those shoulders with it. So as you come down, you're here. Boom. Just get a little step and turn those shoulders on that push out. There you go. Very nice. Now give me an in-out pro cross. And the reason I want you to do the in-out is because I want you to focus on your shoulder turn. Because with this move, well, turning the shoulders is everything. There it is. So much better. That's perfect. Now, let's set it up. So let's come here and let's go between. So, pop, pop, between pro cross. Very nice. So for our fourth cross over here, we're gonna have the cross jab. Let's practice it first. Just stand right here, put your toes on the gray line. Mm -hmm. What you're gonna do is take a right hand dribble, boom, cross over, freeze, and then shift all your weight on the right foot. Perfect. That's exactly how it's done. So try that one more time. Perfect. So the ball will go left, but your body will go right. Do it the other way. Left, boom, step that way. Very nice, okay, that's the move. So as we try to practice it, we're gonna walk through it and just come here, slow, slow, cross, lean. One dribble, just do it just like I did. Boom, one dribble. Okay, because we're going slow-mo, it's a carry. Once you go fast, you don't have to carry, your hand will be behind it, you'll push it, go the other way, left hand. Slow, slow, cross, lean. Very nice. So you did, I want you to do that one again because the mistake you made is perfect. You crossed and you stepped, but you didn't lean. You see this? My weight's not on that foot. Put your weight on the foot. There it is. Now we can go full speed. So now right hand, bring it down, cross over, look that way, step that way, attack the left. Nice. Good. Other way. Very nice. Okay, your counter's off this one. Cross jab. One of the best ones is cross jab into an Iverson. So you've seen people hit this, pop, pop, and the footwork is perfect to get into that next drive. All right, let's go. Left, right, cross. There it is. Very nice. I knew you had it. Now give me that right to left cross jab. Take a dribble, go behind the back, attack the right side. So it's right to left, cross jab, pop, one, behind. Let's get to the basket. Step away, one, behind. It's a great way just to get that first explosive step on the defense. You kind of keep them guessing with it. Now the last one is you're gonna just cross jab and just shoot it. So what it's gonna be is right, left, right. So it's gonna be here, right, left, right, because they just back up too much. They don't even want to choose or guess which side you're going. That's the one, very nice. Great hit, great shot. 